Since I'm so generous, I gather medicinal herbs for his patients sometimes. Here's the leaf house. There you are! We're back! And we brought Aerith with us! Sorry to make you come out here. Don't be. It's on my way home. Well then, I hope you won't mind me asking for some flowers. No problem. How many? All you can carry. What with all the doom and gloom we've been hearing on the news recently, I thought some flowers might help cheer everyone up. I'm sure they will, and I'd love to help. Let's all wash up before our meal. Once they're ready to eat, I'll bring some to your place, Eric. So, Cloud, what's your favorite flower? They're all the same to me. Huh. You sure you want to say that to a florist? Better than lying. Okay. Then what'd you do with the flower I gave you? I, uh... You give it away? I did. Ooh, to who? Tell me. Don't recall. Hmm... What? Thought you didn't like lying. <sighs> well, anyway. My house is just up this path. Mom should be home by now, so I'll introduce you. There you go. That's my house. It's amazing. <laughs> Up to no good? Rude came by. So, this is my mom, Elmira. And this is Cloud, my bodyguard. Uh, hi. Take good care of her? That's my job. <laughs> or was my job. Yep, thanks. So, Cloud, you gonna head back to Sector 7? Yeah. Then I'll show you the way. <laughs> Then why'd you have me bring you here? What if the Turks show up again? It'd suck, but I've dealt with them before. Honestly, I'm much more worried about you. What if you get lost, huh? You'd be too embarrassed to admit it, and so you'd just keep on going. Quit acting like you know me. Hey, Mom. I'm gonna go take Cloud over to Sector 7, okay? <sighs> okay. But why not wait until tomorrow? If you head out now, it'll be dark when you get back. Better to rest up here and make the trip first thing in the morning. When you'll have daylight to spare. That's true. She's got a point, Cloud. Hold up. Oh, yeah. I still need to deliver some flowers to the Leaf House. Since we have a little time before dinner, you should come with. That wasn't the deal. You mean you want more? Even though you've got a priceless reward coming your way, do you know what I promised him? I'll do it. <laughs> <sighs> I'll go grab the baskets. Be right back. <sighs> that Aerith. She's a handful, isn't she? It must be tough. No, never mind. Found him! <sighs> you take this one. Take it. Uh. Hmm. Right. Off we go. <sighs> and these right here are my babies. Do you think we should pick any of them? Oh, don't be like that. I know you have an eye for this kind of thing. 
That's the one I gave you. Huh. It is? Nice try, mister. You can't fool me. I think we still need a few more. Which should we pick next? Whoa, oxtails, huh? I gotta hand it to you. I never would have thought of that. It'll definitely take them by surprise. She said, as many as you can carry, so maybe a few more? Good eye. People used to give these to declare their loyalty to one another. Interesting, right? I'll wait out here. Oh, okay. But I might be a while. Why not check out the town? <sighs> Is something wrong? You could say that. Sounds like someone spooked the kids. Yeah, two of them disappeared. They ran away after this creepy guy wearing black clothes showed up. A Turk? That's what I thought, but no. It's this guy who's always stumbling around town in a dirty robe full of holes. They say he's sick or something. Oh, and he had some kind of number tattooed on his arm. I don't like the sound of this. I'm gonna check it out. I know someone who fits that description. I'll come with. Okay. Come on. Oats! You're back! Aerith's come to help. Yeah, leave it to us. We'll take care of it from here. But there are monsters out there! Don't worry. I've brought a super strong friend along with me. I used to be a soldier. So where's the guy? I don't know. He disappeared and we can't find him. Right now, let's worry about the kids. Come on. I'll go. <clears throat> Come on. Nothing. Is Tifa like your girlfriend? No. Hmm, but she's someone special. It's not like that. More like. I don't know how to explain. I see. Don't worry, it'll be okay. <laughs> Wait! Hmm. Not him. It looks pretty damn similar. Huh? There's the number. But why two? Who knows? Come to think. The reunion. <laughs> Cloud, get it together. Come on. You don't know who Sephiroth is, do you? Sephiroth, the war hero? I know he died in an accident five years ago. They said so on the news. Maybe they did. But I've got a feeling he's still alive. Oh, right. <sighs> Come on, let's go. You're back! Come on, look what we did with the flowers! Lovely, don't you think? Great job. That's wonderful. 
isn't it? Oh, I nearly forgot. I saw some Shinra suit walking towards your house a little while ago. He was dressed all in black. A little scary looking. Hello, Aerith. What do you want? Haven't seen him before. He your new boy toy? He's my bodyguard, if you must know. Wait a minute. Those eyes. Is he the one who beat up Reno? And what if I am? Need to cross my T's, dot my I's, that's all. Cloud, leave him be. Rude's not a bad person, really. No, I'm not bad. But like it or not, I sometimes have to do bad things. <sighs> Don't take it personal. You Turks are all the same. All bark, no bite. You're one to talk. Mm. Okay. <laughs> so, you had enough yet? No, I don't believe that I have. How's that payback working out? Please, just leave us alone. You know I can't do that. <clears throat> hey there, partner. Uh, I'm uh, sure you're having the time of your uh, life, but we're needed on standby uh, for a job at something uh, about Sector 7. Uh, so get your ass back here now. Understood. Got somewhere else to be? Apparently so. Go home and stay there. You know I can't do that. Huh? Too been. Uh, I've been worried sick. Sorry. We got a little sidetracked. Dinner's ready, in case you're wondering. Ah, great. But before we sit down, I want you to make up the guest room. Gotcha. Take a load off, okay? Judging by those eyes, I'm guessing you're a soldier. Ex-soldier. I hate to ask, but would you leave tonight without any fuss, no questions? You boys made a trade, a normal life, for power. You can't have it both ways. I'm back! Good! Now, I hope you're hungry. Starving, right? I've never been so proud. The man you've become? Women must be hounding you day and night. Not really. You know, there's all kinds of temptations in the big city. I'd feel a lot better if I knew you'd found a good girl. One who'd make sure you didn't get into trouble. I can take care of myself. 
An older, more mature girl that could keep you on the straight and narrow, and tell you when you're being a silly goose. That's the perfect type for you, I'd say. Stay my welcome. You're leaving? So, how do I get to Sector 7? It's simple enough. Just cut through Sector 6. It isn't exactly safe, but you should be okay, seeing as you're a soldier. Was one. Promise me, you'll never talk to Aerith again. Please. You got it. Thank you. Oh. Well, look who it is. Talk about a coincidence. What are you doing here? Waiting. Why? Because I'm not sick of you yet. <laughs> Lead on, then. With pleasure. <laughs> Cloud? Is something wrong? It's nothing. <sighs> and that's? The underside of Sector 6. Wall Market. A real special place. But I'm sure you already knew that, right? I didn't tell you? I enlisted pretty much right after I left home. I don't know much about this place, or any of the slums. Well, it took a lot of people to build Midgar, and they all needed to blow off steam. So some traders built an entertainment district. Inns, shops, bars, the works. Folks started pouring in from all over. Business was booming, money was flowing, which attracted the attention of some guys who didn't much care for the law. Now there isn't any. Right. But instead of trying to solve the problem, the government decided to just wall it in. And that's how Wall Market began. Out of sight, out of mind, as the old saying goes. For the folks in charge, there's no better way to deal with it. So it's like a giant veil. Yeah. Wanna see what's behind it? Not really. That's good. Because I know a better way to get to Sector 7. One that, tragically, doesn't go through Wall Market. And it's just through this tunnel here. At least it was, back when I was a kid. <sighs> Anybody around? Guess it's just us. Mm. It's still warm. Should we relight it? Have our own campfire? I need to get back. Besides... Looky here, boys! Caught us some burglars! Coming into our homes and stealing our shit? Doing crimes? <laughs> I'd say we're owed compensatory damages! <laughs> Campament... Composite... I don't get it! Ah. How stupid can you be? It's crazy simple! <laughs> Compensatory damages is like, uh... It's like... Compensation... For damages! Oh, yeah! <laughs> That's what you get when you... Uh, when somebody else... We uh, haven't done anything wrong. Yeah, we were just passing through. Oh, a likely story! <laughs> okay, what do you want? Nothing but our due recompense, that's all. <laughs> due recompense, due recompense, due, due recompense? No uh, oh, shit for brains, due recompense. It's like, uh, uh it's like, uh, 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 compensatory damages. Of uh, course, so damages that. recompense. I, get it for respect. I think we've heard enough. 
Let's be smart. Okay, guys, whatever you do, don't move. Don't look! Just don't look! I'm dead. I'm super dead. Don't give up. That went pretty well. Sure did. <laughs> huh? Wait a minute. Did you just... Nope. Gate to Sector 7. Looks shut. How do we open it? More importantly, how about we take a break? Sound good? No. I don't have time Up for... there looks nice. <sighs> Come on! Huh. <sighs> 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 You know, a long time ago, I used to sell flowers here. Oh yeah? <sighs> so Cloud, you were a soldier first class, right? Yeah. Weird. Really? What's weird about it? Nothing. Just that you were the same rank. Huh? As who? The first guy I ever loved. <sighs> What's his name? I probably know him. Okay. Oh. Wow. Uh. Your eyes. Oh. It's because of the Mako. All soldiers have them. Yeah, I know. Sorry, I'm bumming you out. We should go. <sighs> Gotta look forward, not back. Take long. <sighs> Ready. <sighs> Want to get to Sector Seven in style? This is the passageway for you. getting home and if I said I wasn't I'll go with you I thought you needed to get back <sighs> don't worry I have a backup route for emergencies and it's safer too <laughs> guess this is it then ready yeah.
Cloud, you're alive. I thought we'd lost you. What's going on? Shh. I'll explain everything later. But now I'm on my way to see Don Corneo. You should head back to Seventh Heaven, meet up with the gang. But... I'll be fine. You've seen how much ass I can kick? I have. Yeah! Yeah! Oh, no you don't. You're going after her. She's a big girl. She can handle the likes of him. And worse. Uh-uh. You don't know, Corneo. It doesn't matter how strong or smart you think you are. He'll find a way to turn it against you. And where is she going to meet him? A mansion filled with his goons. Come on. Aren't you worried what might happen in there? You have to help her. Come on! Okay. <laughs> 